Hello and welcome to Verbier for the Mountain of Knowledge. On today's show, how to make friends and influence people on piste. We're learning Euro calves. We've got the 10 day extended snow forecast and more importantly, we've got the farmer's take on the weather. But we're gonna kick off today's show after hours in Verbier. This is Monsieur Pedrus's guide to apres ski. <laughs> It's the Montfort bar. I always leave through the back door. <laughs> hey. Madame Salopette, huh? Un bisou? Maybe a little bit of that wine, huh? Ah. Chardonnay, she knows me so well. <laughs> Alors, this is Verbier, it's après ski. The best après ski in the world. And tonight, I take you, mes amis, on a tour. Pluton, Jaeger, wait, firecracker! This is the Rouge! I'm too late! I have to get to the Farine! We Love the corner! Woo! This is illegal for everyone! Except the king of Verbier, Monsieur Poudrus! Bonsoir! J'ai fait ça! Huh? J'adore le Farinette! My favorite place! Salut! Oh, it left me hanging, huh? Come here, look at this. This is my second home, the Farinette. Catching a beautiful woman oh, is like fishing with God. dynamite. Enchanté. Désolé, mon chéri. Please, please don't go. Mon chéri, I have a job to do. Please don't go. Please. I love it, c'est mon fou. Okay, a little bit of speed. Everybody knows that fun flow downhill, so it ends up here at the Casbah. Hey, G. Voila! <laughs> Am I the last to leave? Yeah, quite normal. <laughs> <laughs> this way. Nearly home, huh? Nearly home. This binding is so uncomfortable. Oh. Ah. No! Pascal, he's closed. The hangover is going to be three times worse tomorrow now without my sandwich. Oh. Quite possibly the worst street section ever filmed. But if you fancy mixing the mountain and your parties, check this link, Verbier Impulse. Two long weekends of festivals in early April. Well worth checking out. Now though, it's time to consider the art of showing off on a snowboard. And for this, we'll need to take to the piste. I'm going bow. Backflips are a perennial crowd pleaser. But if you want to really melt people's minds, you've got to do a turn, fall over, and then miraculously stand back up. That is known as a Euro curve. First of all, get a hold of your sleeve, otherwise it'll fill up with snow. Secondly, make sure the piste is clean. You don't want to take anyone out. Then get your elbow down early and extend your body and then pick up. <laughs> if you twist your belly button upwards at the end of the turn, that'll help you tighten the turn and pick it up. So grab a hold of your sleeve, get your elbow down early, and then extend out, twist your belly button up, and then you'll stand up. It's that easy. If you want to get super hard, you can do switch ones. Come round on your toes, finish the turn, and slide out backwards. Nail the Euro carve and you will be instantly irresistible to the opposite sex. Now though, it's time to see what observing the local environment of Verbier has told the farmer about this week's weather. Un enfant a fait caca dans son pantalon. Il y a la neige jusqu'à mardi, après encore plus de neige. Well, let's test the farmer against the science. 
The snow just hasn't stopped falling, and this map of the last three days proves it. Heavy snow across the northern Alps, nearly a metre up high, but warm temperatures have seen snow getting heavy and wet down low. Well, the farmer is nearly on point. The next three days sees a mix of clear skies and light dustings until Sunday, but the snow gods are shining on Italy. From the southwest right up to the northeast corner, there is over 70 centimetres in the forecast. That starts falling late Saturday. But the big falls kick in on Sunday and it's no longer just about Italy. Three to six days out, look at the temperatures falling and delivering snow across lowland Germany. And that snow stretches right the way down to the northern Apennines in Italy at the bottom of the picture. Six to nine days out and the power band of snow moves north again. Almost all of Austria getting a decent licking and that stretches all the way down through Switzerland and France. After lording it over everyone earlier in the week, Italy misses out on this caking completely. Verbier and Chamonix lead the charge though, accumulating two metres in this three-day period. These models are changing constantly, so for detailed up-to-the-minute forecasts, check snowforecast.com. That's it from Verbier. If you didn't know, now you know.